So, hello, my name is Marcela. Uh, I am a Roma from the east part of Slovakia and I'm studying community development degree at Glasgow University and I'm also one of the founders of the first Roma NGO in Glasgow called Friends of Romanolav. I grew up in a house that divides Roma part of the street from the non-Roma and the position of our house became a kind of symbol of a separation between the Roma and non-Roma world that has highly, highly influenced my Roma identity. I grew up thinking that being Roma is not the greatest thing that can happen to you. Most of the Roma in uh, the place where I'm coming from, they went to the special school in our village, which is commonly known as Ciganska Škola or the Romani school. And only those who were kind of more privileged, they could go to the mainstream school. I always feel bad when I remember that my mother couldn't go to the parents' meeting because her skin was darker. So it was only my father who could go to those meetings because he, although he is Roma, but he doesn't look like Roma. And now I understand why the parents have done it. They basically wanted to protect me. And I also remember that when I was in primary school, from time to time, someone came to our class and said, all Roma or gypsies, the stand up and counted us. And uh, again, I felt very humiliated. And I even didn't know if to stand up or not, because the teachers used to say, uh, they used to say that, Marcella, you, you are not really Roma, you're not like them, you're like us. And then I went to the one of the best grammar schools, but I didn't know who I am, and that has affected my life. But I wanted to be uh, more critical, I wanted to take more critical approaches. So uh, then I decided to study community development at Glasgow University. Uh, there are the barriers we have to face as the Roma community and society, but there are also the barriers we have to face as the Romani woman in the Roma society, of course. And I just believe that one day will come when uh, we will be when the men will recognize women as his equal partners, not only as the mothers of their children. The ideal union between the sexes that shall result in the highest development of the Roma community. So I would say that girls, it is the right thing to get married and to have children, but more I think it's very important to be educated as we Roma women we have a power it is a power to pass our education to our families and to the next generations